I started making theatre when I was six. I found an old wooden box and I painted it with oil paints that never actually dried. And I made puppet theatre shows and I made shows about the things that I was passionate about. Litter, whale hunting, otters. I charged my parents and my friends and my neighbours to come and see the shows and I gave the money to charity. And in truth, my business model hasn't changed much since. <laughs> but this time, it's not a charity. We're a social enterprise, and we're called Co-Resist. But there have been significant changes into what we do and how we do it. This is something that I've thought about a lot, because I've hidden behind the idea that I'm a director, or I'm a producer, or a theatre maker, or I'm an artist, or an educator, or whatever. But actually, what I am, and what we are in Co-Resist, we're change makers. We're activists, and we act. And my act, and my art, is getting others to act. You, right now, you're all actors. You're all playing a role. Some, more so than others. <laughs> but you'll continue to do so collaborating and resisting direction. Your choices are your own, but we do not always own our choices. We're persuaded. We're tricked, we're fooled, we're coerced, we're bribed, we're beaten, and we're bound by familiarity, false gods, and fear, to old ways, bad habits, and bitter endings, too often and too much to the whim of corporations. Now, you don't have to agree with everything that I say to recognise that there's some truth behind the rhetoric. The most important thing is that you agree that things need to change. But you do, because otherwise you wouldn't be here. There are much, much easier ways to free drinks and canapes. I promise you that. <laughs> but what do we actually do at Co-Resist? What's it all about? <clears throat> well, we create experiences and prepare the circumstances for change. We do this through performance and participation. We take our inspiration from the natural world. We are a collective of artists, activists and educators, <clears throat> and we're dedicated to bring about social change. We engage and we enthrall. And we could work for you. We create immersive productions. We create invisible theatre performances. We create innovative and empowering workshops. If you have an issue, or a product, or a problem, or a service, and you need to engage an audience, you can come to us. We design work, like tonight, for a specific audience. And our audience, we know that they are the agents for change. If you're concerned with moving towards a sustainable, equitable, mindful, and inspiring future, if, like us, that you believe that creativity and the natural world are essential parts of this paradigm shift towards creating a better world, and if you believe in the prospect of a better world, then come to Co-Resist. Come and find me afterwards, and come and find out about the workshops that we're creating, the workshops for the Bristol Pound and for Polly Higgins' Eradicating Ecocide campaign. Come find out about our past productions, and about the future productions we have in the pipeline. But more importantly, come and find out about what we could do for you. My name is Daniel Baller, and I'm the founder and co-director of Co-Resist. Thanks.